Okay, and we're recording again. So, so everyone's recovered, in theory. And my character is really fucking terrifying with presents now. Shit. During the download, can I have, have had the uh, Violet go buy feathers? Chicken feathers or bird feathers overall. Yes, she comes back with a bag of them looking very weirded out by your request. Like multiple bags. Okay, she, uh... You know, they gave me the weirdest look at the chicken factory. It's... What, what do you need these for anyway? Rituals. Oh, okay. Or uh, a ritual to be exact. Aren't you supposed to take a live chicken and bite its head off? No. Or no? Go off and take the cameras one every once in a while. Will you? Will you? We have cameras. <laughs> yes. Haven't, I, they, haven't you noticed if I, uh, when you were uh, cleaning the place? I have people do that during the day. I don't clean this place. <sighs> <laughs> well, check the cameras. Okay. Sure. Jesus. Goes off to check the cameras. <laughs> Goes off to the library. Is Alexander's... Uh, <laughs> flow triggered by her mentioning Jesus. <laughs> what? You have a plus on frenzy checks with... Uh... Hmm. Recoils when seeing Christian religious symbol. Oh, so it's just seeing a symbol that you flinch visibly. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, good. All right. Uh, you, Anton, and you, John, at the start of the night, are actually able for the first time to freely move around with any pain, without anything. Everyone more or less seems to be in the house. How would you like to proceed? How much damage do I have currently? At this point, no. you would have been uh, healed. It's been enough downtime. You have just spent plenty of also, time drinking blood and healing. We've just super accelerated how to many, three uh, weeks ahead. How many vital infusions do I have? Um, what is the... Uh, what do I owe? Like, who do I owe debt to? Your the guy that uh, gave it to us. The Nosferatu contact. Mm -hmm. Okay, I wasn't paying attention, sorry. Okay. Uh, You'd for... just be glad we got his phone number without you have without even having to look at your phone. <laughs> oh no, a ghoul came by looking for Anton to see how they could get in contact if they needed each other. <laughs> and Jackalor, uh, given that you've reawakened two vampires who are extremely... extremely fucked up, I would say that you're full blood and you have... Let's say 15 of those currently on hand. Okay, I'll be adding that to my inventory. And that was really loud. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Oh, and we will, uh, we will commit the Voldery. And we need to bring him into the pack. As everyone gathers around a fresh batch of barrels of blood. <laughs> Tonight we begin once more. Renew the oaths of blood to our blood brothers. A oh, Violet quietly backs out of the room. <laughs> Turns around, walks. What are you doing in here? Ow! She just walks off to the kitchen. <laughs> picks up her face as you yell out after her, I'm gone, I'm gone! <laughs> and yes, he just started literally when everyone's right there. Acting as if... They there was prep time or something. <laughs> okay, how do you react to this, Anton? I just raise an eyebrow. Doesn't really affect me. To accept our new blood brother, who is... Um... Well, he likes, he likes things. He's not an artist. He's all right. <laughs> raise, raise of thumbs for who accepts and who does not accept our new blood brother. I raise my thumb. 
Thumbs up. I Thumbs nod. Up. I nod to each of them as they do it. The do I raise my thumb? thumb. <laughs> Actually, yeah, do you raise your thumb, Satan? Oh, I raised my thumb. Okay. Okay. You realize at this point that you forgot to bring the hammer. I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> he raises another eyebrow. I'm glad you picked up on that one. I said no prep whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> two minutes later, two very long minutes later, seeing a uh, very pale looking Violet in the kitchen as you go running into the garage on your way, Satan, you come back in with the hammer. <laughs> At this point, you uh. realize that you don't have a fire going. <laughs> <laughs> uh, flames, flames, flames. <laughs> Basically, I'm setting up the prep right in the middle of the ritual, yes. <laughs> Eight minutes later, we finally got everything ready and set. <laughs> you just watch as Satan slowly, with his meager strength, chops a couple of chairs apart. One of them was a family ale room, Alexander. I honestly don't care. He douses them in lighter fluid. He's about to start another fire, I think. Yes, in a barrel. Nope, on the floor, between the barrels. The plastic barrels, which may well melt. Why are you starting a fire on the floor? Sure. Uh... It goes up. We need the fire. <laughs> on the floor. Uh, it's crackling merrily. Someone uh, get water here. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, Alexander, I want you to roll an intelligence roll. Just straight up intelligence. At six. Difficulty. Six. You realize that you have completely forgotten about Darnell these past three weeks. And he has been tied up in the library this whole time. Who cares? He's a vampire. All right. I have been down there uh, multiple times. I would have noticed if he's been running around. You More accurately, I think, he's, I think he's just in a hunger torpor at this point. Probably, yes. I don't care. <laughs> what should I care? <laughs> He's a failure. He doesn't deserve anything at this He's point. He's an experiment. I try. I, I right now I don't care about him being in hunger torpor. It's a good thing actually. Okay. Since you have all done this before at least once, and you have had the opportunity to get used to pain, and. As for Anton's backstory, he's already used to pain as to, uh... Uh, as, well, it's as a difficult day to roll now, essentially, cause, Yay. and it's probably gonna keep going down if you keep doing it. It depends how many people roll? we go through. Now instead of what? Eight. Difficulty eight. Willpower. Okay. Roll, buh, mother. Wow. Oh my god. With a stone-cold look, Satan places his thumb on the roof of the barrel and smashes it into a paste while looking you in the eye, Anton. Alexander proceeds to do the same, and I toss the thumbs into the fire. John, on the other hand, starts weeping like a little bitch and is not Actually, able that's to... Actually, it's the bot. That's not the bot. It's not a bot, but uh, that means that initially he can't do it. He can't bring himself. John just keeps looking back at you, at the dump, at you at the dump, tracing the camera, putting it up. Oh! I stare at John like... And I, I, I form a silent judgment. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have enough information to know that he my just cousin say, is a little bitch, so... He just say, oh, that's my favorite clown. I like to torture people with Yeah, that. you grow back. It grows back. Should we spend blood points on this uh, to 
Like, Presumably, this is du- happening during the last couple of days of the okay. downtime. This is when everyone's happen- healed up and ready. So This is happening at the last... This is happening essentially on the current night. Because it okay. will take them Either way. six days left of downtime to actually heal up after they're woken and... Yeah. Alright. If that's how it is, that's fine. Also, can I add another uh, another five or six days to my ritual? Uh, six days, sure. If that's what you were doing. So I roll again. You can roll again. <laughs> Facing Anton's judgment, John tries again. He just really. <laughs> But they liked so much. Less time <laughs> took like one day to go back. All right, the Malkavian can kind of get away with it. He's kind of crazy. It, uh, whatever. John, John just, is supposed to be the badass. He's just holding his thumb out on the edge of the barrel, hammer raised, throws it, looking down on it, eyes screwed, almost shut. Like any second now. <laughs> Would you like to try it again, John? At this point, uh, John might actually start taking a hit in the Malkavian's eyes. Finally, Finally. he brings the hammer down. Which is, ah! The dog looks away, not even looking, just starts whacking away. <laughs> and finally manages to toss the thumb into the fire. We Goodbye, accept you, um. brother. <laughs> now we begin the next thing. Uh, where did I put that? To? I love how Satan does this ritual, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> We're going on to the next stuff. We're doing the next thing. Uh, and then Satan will uh, uh, start looking in. around. Uh, Violet rushes in with a... Uh... Essentially, blender cup. Go on her knees, holding it up to Satan, shaking. I look at Violet and smile. Aha! She's not looking at you, she's Thank looking you. at the floor. Okay. She okay. rapidly backs out. My, well, have fun. Maybe she talked to Darnell <laughs> during the before he fell asleep. You know. I'm just to remind you, Thane is both terrifying and amazingly personable. Yes. More so than the others, at least. I could offer to uh, modify Violet. Please, Not don't yet. don't modify her. Uh, you have fun with other things. I said I that. Do I have can. fun. No. Uh, no. I would answer, no, Do find your own rules to do it, too. That's I awful. figured you'd probably bring it up at some point during downtime. That's kind of why I was answering it. Mm. No. Okay. It's just so... Yeah, if we're Everyone's... in a moment and you don't say it's out of character, it's in character. We'll go with that. I can be in character whenever. I'm talking to the air. I did say it was out of character earlier. It's just y'all were derping a little bit. Whatever. Oh, so Time to go. it's our fault. Who went in... To attack the war party and didn't even get a kill. Hmm? That was me. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to begin the, the bloodletting. All right. Awesome. He he uh, gets the cup, brings out a pair of scissors. There you is know, a pair little... of uh, nail clippers already in the cup, ready for you to use. Where's my scissors? The scissors are with you. But uh, oh. Violet has apparently offered you an alternative tool if you would like to use this instead. No, no, the the, the scissors are what we use. These are put, these are important. Takes out a pair of what appears to be, you know, sharp kindergarten scissors. <laughs> Again, my eyebrow raises a little bit. <laughs> You don't remember this yet. ritual going like this. <laughs> I've done this ritual before, I believe, and I don't remember the blunt scissors that they give kindergarten. They're not blunt. They're not. Dude, 
Okay, to apparently me, my they look like. was weird. They're colorful. Yeah. What color? Was it just me? me they would look them. like. To me, they would look blunt. Okay, if they look blunt to you, that's fine. But was I because the only one that apparently had a kindergarten that used just tiny, colorful scissors? No, no, no you're not the only one. They definitely had it. No, too. no, but but see, are Satan. you talking about the ones that are pointy or the no. ones that are brown? The ones that are rounded. Satan, describe rounded. them. That's... What color are they? Are they, they stars? Are they rainbows? They're they are purple, and they both have both stars and rainbows. Oh my god, that's fucking perfect. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And yes, you saw the the uh, the strange structure outside. It gets no more blood because I'm using it all. <laughs> Fuck that structure. Okay, in that case, I need to roll for the anger of the gods. <laughs> Scree! Yay? Oh no, yay. that's not a good yay. With four successes, that's not a good yay. But you don't need to worry about that. That's fine, don't worry about it. Even if it was a difficulty eight, it would still be four successes. Indeed. But you hadn't angered it before, that's why it was difficulty eight before. Whatever. I Go didn't on. anger Come it. On. I simply not, did, uh, we simply uh, stopped. Cut not your it. wrist. I cut my wrist. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> and everyone's, you know, putting their blood into a little, the little cup. Kinda wish it was a red solo cup, but it's all right. He'll do. How much? How many blood points do I give? There's you don't have to give one. one. I uh, can only hear one person at a time, so did you just say one? Yeah. It's generally one. Okay. If you wish, more can be added. It won't have any particular effect, though. Comes back to me. And I shall bless it upon Cthulhu. May he have enough. May the darkness whispers into my eyes. The dream creature watches. All right. Have a seat. Inside at difficulty nine, as you say this about Cthulhu. You feel a vague disapproval from somewhere far off. That's all you pick up. I'll have to do better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I blame John Doe. All right. So, time for Voldery rolls. Yeah. Yay, 1d10. Roll Who gets a 10 40 this time? time. Roll 4d10. You roll for each person. Okay. 4d10. Well, I'll just dictate whether the first is to, uh, you know, our new Anton or not. Because uh, that's dictating the The way you are initial. on the map, go start from Satan and go clockwise. All right. Start from Satan, go clockwise. So, so Anton's I'm last. last. Okay. Yes. So, Nietzsche, just so they're all... These are sorted. This doesn't work. I have a nine oh, for you. Oh, shit! I don't give a shit about Anton. <laughs> I have an eight okay. for him. Since it's no. Maybe three dots, that's four. Jackalor, 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 Jackalor. Um, yes. These are sorted. Don't use the stuff from the bottom. Reroll it. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. And you um. don't roll for yourself, so it would be two, five, and six, Satan. Two, five, and six. Wait, I forgot. We do have it sort. No, I don't have it sorted. Yay! Yes. I don't so Nietzsche, just roll two more. D10s. Just uns either type it in or use the roll function. Don't use D1, D2, D3, D10 because those are sorted these days. Wait, I think I screwed up. There's only three rolls, isn't it? Yes, yeah. so the one wouldn't count. Yeah. Oh, dang it. Well, that's So, six bad. on John. And the rest didn't reach high yeah. enough to go even higher. So. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so if you're above what you had previously, it goes up by one essentially, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yep. Okay. So uh, adjust your Valdery ratings accordingly. Nietzsche would have a Valdery rating of eight with Satan, uh, three with John, and two with Alexander. So you can actually tell him to go and fuck himself, essentially. But I am actually fairly. You're fairly loyal to me. Don't yeah. you mean? Uh, wait, Alexander. Do you mean Anton? No, Anton. no, I was talking to Nietzsche, I believe. Yeah, so, Nietzsche. Satan's got six on me. Is that what that is? Yeah, I got six on you, you got eight on me. Okay. So I'm a little more screwed. Alright. I th No, you're better off, actually. Anton, you have... Or, sorry, uh, Jack Lord, you have seven with Anton. I'm not sure... Yes. I think I yours went... I my Valdery ratings uh, just a second ago, so it was... Two, one, and zero before. Well, mm -hmm. null value for Anton. So it would be three, two, and seven. Okay, good. Excellent. So you feel a new sense of fellowship with your fellow vampires. What do? Did I drop? No, you didn't drop as far as I know. You did drop. This is the netherworld. This is the game where everything goes wrong for you. You have stumbled into hell. So let's see. Oh, I came back. I don't know about Bacon. Bacon might have actually... Oh, Bacon has eight on him. I'm here. And might have increased on somebody. No, I don't think he did. I think it was a nine no. on him. My lord. I don't care about you guys so much. No, it doesn't well, lower. Actually, it only lower if you roll a one. Yes. Yeah. Oh. It doesn't reset entirely. That would be far too yeah. easy. In fact, it generally goes up. Okay. That's the idea. Well, you're doing this. Still, a sombra pushes the doors open. Goes open. Oh, Fight. Oh, I'm interrupting something, aren't I? No, uh, we're done. Yes. Uh, am I correct? Oh. Uh, let's see. We're naked. What? He starts putting away the prep. <laughs> At this point, the uh, sides of the barrels of blood have melted, and they go splooshing all over the fire, putting it out. All right, we're good. <laughs> the floor is really? now covered in blood. Hundreds of liters uh, of it. I'll ha I have to have, uh, have, to have my ghoul. Uh, I have to have my ghoul take care of that. Yes, Carlo? It is good to formally meet you now. I offer my hand. He looks down on it, looks you in the face. I suggest that before you act as my equal, you display at least a minimum of competence so I don't have to rescue you from every passing Camarilla neonate. Satan is staring. This is where Alexander dies, by the way. <laughs> I'm nonchalantly Blame it on John, there. Uh, John and Anton over there. They had a uh, quick question. To foolishly attack the uh, Camarilla without t informing anyone. Is Carlo actually an acquaintance at this point? Uh, you can... S well, you have seen him twice now, so... Eh. But... During this conversation, if you're just watching, you can definitely try and pick up his nature, which I haven't picked out yet, for reasons. Just tell me when you figure it out at any point. Mm -hmm. There. How's that? Sure. Alexander, roll charisma expression. Okay, that would be... Do not sound like a whiny bitch. Okay, I was actually just really asking, you know, is he a stranger at this point? Difficulty. Six. I have every faith in your ability to fuck this up. Or oh, not. no! I'll presume, I'll presume that. <laughs> I sound very, very convincing. It was John Doe and Anton's fault. And Anton Rose's fault. Alright, so whenever you feel like, no, you know, you making said... nature form, yeah. actually. So. so, Alexander, you just said that they went off without telling you. Yes. That's what you said, so... 
Carlo I just... said it was it was their fault due to them not essentially running off and not telling me. Carlos steps past, looks at you, Anton, turns to John, looks back to you. All right, would you please explain what the idea behind that was? Now, it's... hey, I was just I was just told to show up and help. John said, "Let's go," and I followed. Yeah, he seemed pretty convincing. Thought he could take him. No, the plan was just watch, but Anton decided to, after detect detecting the enemy, stay behind and don't try to leave after seeing how much there was. So we have to fight them. I, you were that, pretty gung ho about, a lie. yeah, yeah, role manipulation. Yeah, you didn't stay to watch. You didn't go just to watch. You went to fight. <laughs> Yes, no, you I did. No, I stayed to verificate, but... No, you did to go no, to say to You went to fight. You, you actually You, you were out. really gung-ho about it. And then when you got there, you got really, uh, you know, is this really a good idea about it? After but the initial telling convinced... Anton that you were going in as well, and then obfuscating yeah, you... and being a little bitch. Yeah, you didn't explain anything, and you definitely seemed like you were going to attack. Not to watch. Yes. So, yeah. Bacon, raw manipulation subterfuge. I already rolled for him secretly and be lucky. Be lucky like you've never been lucky. Can I spend my only willpower? <laughs> no, I want to. It doesn't to usually work for subterfuge. It does actually, but. Uh, well, actually, it does. It does it just, I doubt it would help. He. Raises uh, both eyebrows in shock. Like, really now, neonate. If you ever lie to my face like that again, you're gonna have a slight problem. Yeah, he ran like a little bitch. He turns to Anton. Did he now? Yeah, he sure did. He obfuscated and left me. I was ready oh, to do my duty. Actually, I was watching you the entire time. So much that's that a, I killed the painter guy. Lie. No, I was watching. That was the truth. No, you ran. He ran afterwards. He did stay until he engaged with William, and I think. He did try. He to did stay that's for the engagement. That's not how I, I didn't, remember, though. He didn't stay for the torpor, as far as I remember. No, he just stayed... No. For yeah. a moment. Yeah, he stayed for a moment, then he ran, leaving his buddy behind. So, yeah, saying he stayed and watched in that context is absolutely a bald-faced lie. May I, uh... May I try to, like, uh, talk to Carlo, uh, using uh, my charisma? You can. I, I, am, I apologize for the artist. He, he is... He is a little dumb. He, he does dumb things sometimes. Uh, I apologize. Who's the artist again? If you'd mind forgiving him just, you know, for his stupidity, uh, at least this time, we would be very, very grateful. Uh, huh. He turns to you, John. Well, you seem to have impressed your priest, at least. You get to live, for now. If you ever... Well, you led a member of the Sabbat, and a respected member at that, a useful neonate to a near certain death, and you left him there. Well, you ran, like he said, like a little bitch. Don't do that again, or it's the last thing you'll ever do. Is that clear? Yeah. Yes, yes. I'll, 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 uh, I'll, I'll make sure he's uh, punished for this. Yes. May I use uh, manipulation, uh, or may I use charisma etiquette to bow? You can. If you to wish. my to my superior. Sure. Eats. Keep in mind, if you botch this, you will fall face first into the blood and splashed all over him. Oh, well, 
Do it. You are going to do it. That's probably what's going to happen. Can I, can I spend? Can I spend willpower? Do you want to spend a will? <laughs> Just so I don't want. I want to make a good impression. How many dice do you even have? Uh, like, why would you do that? Why? Dude, it, it doesn't you... matter how well you do on that. He's not even expecting any real etiquette from here. We I... ran, we ran okay. the neonates. So I'm... bad neonates at that. I'm not even sure he would care. It's quite likely he wouldn't. Unless you were like yeah. another Lasombra, then he might, because, you know, that's just kind of a thing they do, but... Alright, I don't want to look like a bootlegger, so... Okay. Mm-hmm. It's not exactly play my guy, so... So, what... I hope you what? don't suffer from social Darwinism that they follow. Have fun. So, what exactly happened? to cause this fun little excursion the camera launched. Because I'm curious as to why they would target your pack specifically, what with there being now three packs in Toluca. Hmm. Uh, well, the, I the only time I, uh, I was uh, aware of, of uh, agitating, uh, that there was agitation towards the this wolf gang fellow, there uh, was when uh, John Doe and what was the other guy name from the other pack, Lynn Davis. Line. Uh, Lynn Line. Davis decided to go, uh, decide, uh, decided to go, uh, to do a shouting contest on who would be the most insulting towards this wolf gang. Line one. He I was, was not informed of any of that. <laughs> you wanted to join, say the uh, greetings. Uh. Carlo just looks at them all okay, and goes, Are you sure you want to extend your protection over this one? I'm sure we could arrange it. a replacement easily enough. I... I he, he should be here for now. All right, <laughs> then. Are you sure you extend your protection to this complete buffoon? Yo, you, it's actually, uh, it feels very much like what he would do. I feel very in character with this. All right. Just don't, just be wary. Uh, punishment is coming. <laughs> I know that. And this thin blood. What of him? They believe he was stalking to the Camarilla? Yes, currently in the basement, I've been prepa- I've been preparing to examine him further. He has oh. been fun, doll. We talk. I met his mother. Really? You? <laughs> <laughs> I'm completely uh, I'm completely perplexed by this. Huh? You were shouting at uh, something about his mother Enough. after you examined him. Enough. Enough. Yeah. You have been preparing to examine him for three weeks. I was I was trying to learn the thaumaturgical ritual required to raise my companions from torpor. And have you now memorized said ritual? I am get, grow, I'm getting very close. Uh huh. Funny. Lynn said that you were an authority on uh, occult studies and thaumaturgy. I must re-examine yes, my evaluation. Yes, together with me. I must re-examine my evaluation of Lynn. Clearly, he's not that perceptive. Mm. <laughs> Out of character, I definitely agree with the not that perceptive part. <laughs> ah, what I are see the things. camera of forces? How organized were they? Uh, they had connections, things. All right. I need any. They were well prepared. 
two yes, groups. Did I, actually, uh, could I inform him of basically the composition of the party that was there? You know about, well, essentially the Ventru and the Tremere, the uh, Toreador you never actually met until before John ate him. I was actually just uh, from that, you know, the location and everything. That probably gave me a really good idea on uh, what what was they were doing and what they were was going on and all that. Who was leading it? In general, mm-hmm. you have well, you would have known that there were three vampires and four or five ghouls in total. Yeah. Uh, there, there was. Three, three of us. Wait, three of them. Mm. Three, three of the living walking. Ah, three of the dead walking. Uh, four or five of the of the half breeds. Uh huh. So they're using thin bloods, is what you're saying. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, live. They live with blood, with our blood. There was a ghoul. There are multiple ghouls uh, that they had with them. Ah, uh, he turns to Alexander. Is he incapable of talking normally, or just unwilling? Incapable and unwilling at the same time. Okay, it's, roll manipulation subterfuge, because he did at one point say that he would drop the bullshit and talk normally to you guys. Yes, he's you know, he's still been talking un- and unnaturally at at the same time. Yeah, he is. He has fun with it. He is, I did say that he has fun with it. <laughs> like I am, I personally don't. Uh, personally, in character and out of character, I'm not sure what the fuck you're doing with that. <laughs> yes, so that's good. That means I'm doing Malkavian right. <laughs> sure. That being the case, it would still be a subterfuge role, I believe. <laughs> uh, uh... Since you don't I know, personally, don't fathom how it would be, but at the same time, I have no I understand perfectly. It's weird. <laughs> I know that feeling you get. <laughs> it makes perfect sense why you're making me do this, and yet it doesn't make sense why this is doing this. <laughs> like I have no idea whether or not whether whether or not he's completely just justified. Yeah, just just go with it. Just go with it. <laughs> sure. Like. Um, your char- if he if he tells, it's going to be that your character has heard something before, but is completely unsure on whether or not you know what's going on <laughs> with the Malkavian. Can you use the manipulation of cult for this? Sorry, what? Manipulation of cult? No, you uh. really can't. Uh. Eight six, I got the success. <laughs> he just so he would, if he does, he does see through me, which he did. I'm going to say that he seemed perplexed rather than you know actually attempting to lie, uh, 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 being a little lying bitch. That's that's probably how he'd see it too. That's what I was saying. It's not that you're trying to uh, he really turns tell to Satan and goes, listen, um. I'm going to try and put this simply. I know how many packs you've had before this. I know that they all ended badly, with you being pretty much the only survivor in most cases. So why don't you just give me the information I want? And I'm not going to go into the details of how you you always ended up being somewhere else when your packs horribly died with these people Uh... here. Okay. I remember that kind of takes away some of the fun. I remember in particular that one case with the two gangrel. That was fun. I remember there was just pieces of meat everywhere, wasn't there? When you came on the site, that was an interesting situation, wasn't it? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, we were playing the games. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the game. So why don't you tell me about the Camarilla, okay? Okay, there was three vampires, uh, and four or five ghouls or so. They were in two different groups, uh, I'm, yeah. 
I knew their locations. We tried to do stuff. They just ran in there. No planning or whatsoever. They just did it immediately after. Yeah, I'll punish this one badly. All right. I see. So you somehow... He glares at John. Managed to piss off one of the more powerful princes in the area. And put Toluca on the map. Isn't that wonderful? Uh, you know, from my understanding, uh, Toluca was already on the map, but that did accelerate things a lot. Yes. They had several scouts on on this pact and the other one. I killed the first one before sending back information, but the second one, uh, I, I did not saw on the other pact saw, but I did not. Alright, fair enough. I will say that even though that's a good point, it did sound kind of like somebody desperately grasping at straws. <laughs> yes, it does. It kind of is. <laughs> Alright. Well, ah, oh, shit! I know exactly what I'm going to do to punish him too. Ah, oh, fuck! You're gonna well, hate me. Well, we had hoped that this city would remain ignored by the Camarilla for a while longer, but it's nothing for it now. Well, you're very lucky that your priest has been doing a good job of making our actions very hard to notice in here. With the hard work he has been doing here. He pats you on the shoulder. Don't think your efforts haven't been appreciated. Well done. We are all pre Thank pleased you. by your initiative. Who, are they? who, who is he talking to? Satan. The sa yeah, okay. Satan. Okay. Yes, I try. Hmm. I hope the chaos is going to obfuscate any moves we do in this t city. I will continue to build it. Oh, and uh, get some security for this place. I was able to just walk right in without you noticing me. He turns mm -hmm. around and uh, leaves. Also, I'm. Uh, well, after he has left, I'll be. Uh, Violet, get over here. Violet, well, w walking off to where she. Say it now. We'll. Uh... Put his hands on John's shoulders. <laughs> John, would you like to react to this? He just look at him with uh, the half-closed eyes. John, you have been a very bad boy lately. <laughs> you must be punished. Here comes the mindfuck. Please, not the, not the brooms. I, I smile and remove. take my leave. I now remove the enjoyment you have in life. The passion. I dull his emotions. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking perfect roll for it. Uh, what's your path rating? Four. Four? Okay. Good. Not too at terrible bad, just a month, I think. So for the next month, all the torture, it's really not going to hit the spot the way it's used to. Ah, it's actually only one week. I've rolled pretty bad. Oh. oh well. So I have for the next week, I will kill the triple of people expecting some fun from it. But you will be torturing them and then killing them. And you won't feel anything for it. Maybe a very slight enjoyment, nothing else. I will probably set that back up if I notice he's uh, walking around a week later. Mm -hmm. But yeah, do note that uh, your emotions are now dulled. Minus two modifier on certain things up to the ST. 
Although it is now harder to make you uh, affected by presence as well. Aww. <laughs> all right. Again, dementation. It has all kinds of effects. Dementation OP. Okay. Yes, no. Isn't insight usually a thin blood thing, though? It is actually a Malkavian and thin blood thing. Mm-hmm. All right. It is straight up said in the Malkavian handbook that they can take it. So I I did both. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Anton, what do you do as you walk off? Where do you head? What do you do? Uh, find a phone, and I'm gonna make a contact with the uh, drug dealer. No. Okay. Whatever. All right. You have to admit, so that I have a pack of heroin. That was a pretty good punishment, I think. I do. By the way, what is the name of this drug dealer? Since I don't think I ever wrote it down. I haven't picked it out yet because I did not expect you to. Well, I did think this was a possibility, but yeah. Uh, what would you like his name to be? His name is Bob. Okay, Bobby answers. Everyone's Bob now. Can't you be any... You could just at least say Tim. Look, look, he's a Tom. No, no, he's Bob. Bob the Dark, as his street name goes. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh, also, welcome back, Michi, by the way. We're glad to have you. Uh, sorry for almost killing you. <laughs> sorry for almost no, no, that was you, but it was that was very, perfect. very, would have been very rewarding. That was very, very per That was hilarious, actually. <laughs> okay. Uh, Three generations. It was so great. So, I call Bob up. And I say, hey. Who the fuck is this? Don. What's going on? The fuck have you been? I've been trying to reach been... you for two weeks before I gave up. What the fuck, dude? You invite me to this town and then you just vanish? What the frack is wrong with you? Ah, uh, yeah, I apologize. I I got hung up. Uh, Dude, some issues. you yeah. do not do that to Bob the Dark. I have customers to serve. I have shit to do. Apologies. So it is Bob the Dark. <laughs> Listen, I like you. You are very useful. You do your job. You don't ask questions. But seriously, I'm going to have to cap your ass if you ever pull this kind of bullshit again. Uh, I'm sorry. My apologies. Deepest apologies, really. Real charismatic uh, at, at difficulty uh, 7, given your casual tone. <laughs> uh... Do I just roll my charisma, or do I roll charisma etiquette? Charisma etiquette. Can I spend willpower? Because <laughs> I don't want to mess this up. If you want. <laughs> not going to. Okay, not going to. He's going for you solo act. You know what? Yes, I am. This is important. All right. All right. So I got two successes. One. I spent the willpower. He did say afterwards oh, that did. he was spending it after all. Uh, okay. He <laughs> says, uh, the clan Nosferatu accepts your apologies. Wait, what? <laughs> 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 no, no. He's, well, okay, fine. We'll just forget about it as long as it never happens again. Fine. <laughs> Hey, listen. I'm ready to. I'm ready to sit up here. So uh, whenever you're ready to uh, get cooking, I mean, just uh, give me the word. I mean, I mean, you're not set up yet, even. No, no, really predisposed. What have you been doing? 
sleeping. <laughs> Fighting off mafia. <laughs> okay, dude. Coma. Two of our guys got shot up, and we sort of patched them up, but we could use someone who can take a proper look at them. Can you like come over and see if the veterinarian fucked it up or something? Also, this place <laughs> yeah. is great. We haven't even had police come over yet. These riots and shit. Damn, this is a good place to set up. You have you had a good choice. <laughs> yeah, I can do that. Just uh, give me the location. Uh, how about we come and pick you up? That works too. Okay. You proceed to head out then. Also, am I hooded? <laughs> Yes, you most definitely are, and they search you for wires very carefully. Awesome. I'm gonna... Well, should I use my aspects to see where I go? With one level, it would be a difficulty eight. I don't think I care. I think I care it... enough. Mm -hmm. They're just a money... They're just money bags to me, so... Uh, keep in mind, your blood would be at uh, 14 right now, because you would have been able to freely feed over the... Actually, no, it would be at 9. Because hmm. you would have healed yep. a point of aggravate last night. Okay. Okay, so, you arrive on location, and it is indeed two guys... Who are just resting up there. You may uh... How did this happen? Okay, I'll take a look at him. Let me just uh, place Bob there so you have something to look at. Bullets, matey. Bullets. <laughs> Wouldn't that be rum? You know, back by the way. People get shot when you have a gang war. We have a lot of those these days. <laughs> Go on, check them out. Okay. I walk over to the one that looks like he's uh, in the worst shape. <sighs> Difficulty to roll at. Just they six. both seem to be, well, similar states. So, yeah, roll at six, and... Uh, Alright, one of them seems okay, but uh, the other... It seems like the veterinarian did fuck up, and the wound is uh, slowly getting infected. Huh. This one's okay, but this one right here... Looks like sepsis is taking place. Um, probably start him on a round of antibiotic or something. Have any supplies where that's concerned, but, uh, I mean, can you get antibiotic? Uh, I, shit, I, I guess we need to hit a drugstore or something, jeez. Yeah, I mean, like, penicillin. Uh, genomycin, anything with a sin at the end of it's usually pretty good for uh, infections you don't know about. I love your real life experience coming in there. <laughs> <laughs> it's always great when that happens. I want you to roll uh, perception alertness at difficulty 9. Well, that sucks. You think you catch a faint whiff of the sewer around Bob or one of his underlings. Mm. I shrug it off. <laughs> Alright, so just what? Pump him full of this stuff? How the fuck do we know how much to give him? Ah... Uh. Uh, 
and if I, the bottle usually tells exactly how much is on it. They come prepackaged. Uh, just keep them on the 30-day round, one pill a day. Take it with food. Okay, sure, whatever. Jesus, fucking 30 days. Jim, if you ever get shot in the gut again, so help me. He should be he should be fine to uh, actually resume work and such in about 15 days or so, but you don't want the infection coming back. So yeah, you just keep him going, keep that, keep make sure he can take his own medicine. You don't have to baby him or anything. He's an adult. You hear that, bitch? You're going back to the kitchen. You know, it's it's good to have you back, Anton. Glad to be back in the field. Hmm. So, you were talking about he uh, puts a hand on your shoulder, leading you out. So you wanted to set up a uh, a little side operation to uh, help provide us with supplies, was it? Uh, I can make medicines and such. Uh, antibiotics might be a little harder to do, but I can do it. Uh, but, you know, the pharmaceuticals I'm thinking of, mostly recreational. Exactly my thoughts. Exactly my thoughts. Do you have something specific in mind? Hmm. Well, I haven't really gotten a feel for the city yet. If it's a party scene, maybe a little ecstasy, uh, molly, that kind of deal. Or, you know... No, no, it's more the people who are looking for a religious experience here, quotes, getting closer to God. LSD, then. We can do LSD. Uh, I might can tweak the formula a little bit to uh, make it a little more dependent. I'm not sure. I'll have to mess with it. No promises, but uh, that's something I would like to do. Uh -huh. I mean, everybody likes LSD. All right, all right. He uh, hands you, uh, what was it for one dot of resources, 200 bucks? Mm -hmm. 400, um, I think, actually, but... It was 500 for two, I know that. Okay, yeah, he hands you a uh, few bills. So this is for tonight. Oh, thank you. And uh, I I'm going to need, like, flasks and such to actually set up a lab or something like that to... Uh, get this going, but I mean, it shouldn't be that hard. I have a place to work. Well, how about I come in and check the place out, make sure that it's secure. You don't really have that much experience keeping places safe from cops and the like. Uh, well, the the only problem with that is that we'd have to talk with uh, Head Honcho of the place I'm living at, you know. Oh, so he there's someone else we would need to cut into this. See, Anton, that's why I don't like you. You failed to mention these things up front. I mean, this wasn't really going to come out of your cut. Uh-huh. See, the more people know, the worse it gets because there's more people that can fuck it up, you know what I mean? Yeah. And then the bodies start piling up, and it's a big mess, and you know how it is. Well, yeah, I understand that. But, you know, you have to have a place to work. You gotta have uh, allies in a new city and such. You're a good ally. Uh, and I vouch for these guys, to some extent. You know. If, uh... Well... Why don't I come on by and meet them? I'll let them know that you are coming. Tomorrow. He then. may need a little time. In the evening. Tomorrow? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm up in the evening times. I'm not much of a day person. Oh, me Shh. neither. That's when the cops are out. Yeah. I can surprisingly speak from being, you know, night shift for a couple of years now. Police are not out at night. They are sometimes, but it is very rare. 
they're out, but they're usually napping or they're setting up to take someone down an easy target. <laughs> That's what they do. All yeah, right. they're they're not there very often. Almost never. I'm surprised whenever I see a cop. Yeah, even when I speed past a cop, they just they just put their lights on and like, hey, slow down, because <laughs> they don't hey, want to. Hey, nice to see you. Okay, hey, quit I'm, that. I'm gonna <laughs> split the video here, and uh, we'll continue right away, I suppose.